Welcome to Demon School Iramakun is about a boy whose parent sells him to a demon, but as it turns out, the demon's actually a pretty nice guy and just wanted to adopt him as a grandson, and so he's taken to demon school, where he's supposed to be learning to be a better demon. But if any of the other demons at the school find out he's a demon, they're gonna eat him. The setup itself reminds me a lot of Haida no Gotoku or Rosario Vampire. But the show does manage to go in its own unique direction in that the primary focus of the show seems to be about Irima making friends and going on adventures, usually with a comedic tone in the school. And it also seems to be leaning up to the implication that Irima might be the next Demon King because the throne is vacated. The show manages to cover a like wide variety of topics. It, it gets into sort of a little bit of the politics of the demon world, but it also manages to keep things more grounded with school events such as clubs and sports activities and tests and things like that. It manages to handle all of its aspects very well. It's got a very strong side cast. The main character is likable. He's got a love interest who is just delightful, but even more than that, the, the development of the romantic subplot is actually pretty well handled because it has two leads and they interact with each other and have bonding moments and chemistry. It has exciting, intense moments. It's actually funny. I will say that there was a sort of juke during the club arc, and I think that went on for a little too long. I started losing a little bit of interest there. But what I also will say is that it went in an interesting and unforeseen direction with that, because it introduces the leader of their club, and I was like, okay, this guy seems kind of boring, but then it puts a little twist that I didn't see coming. And it manages to, with that arc, not only manage to make the arc interesting and go in an unforeseen direction, but it also helps function as credible world building and seemingly allows the plot to move forward. So the show is very good at operating at multiple angles at once. Overall, it's just a really good, fun series. Twitch and Discord in the description. I've been Sacrobolic, your Envoy of Hope. Bye-bye!